Hello, deserving listeners. It's just me today. I thought I would talk about family of origin therapy. In a previous episode, I talked about how I would talk about this, and some patrons were asking me to talk about it. So here we go. This is the Psychology in Seattle podcast. I'm your host, Dr. Kirk Honda. I am chair of the Couple and Family Therapy Program at Antioch University, Seattle, and I'm also a licensed marriage and family therapist. Today, I'm going to talk about family of origin therapy. I'm going to talk about the history of family of origin therapy. I'm going to talk about the theory involved. And I'm going to, I'm going to talk about my own experiences, mainly in teaching family of origin therapy to other family therapists. In my program, we walk our students through a version of family of origin therapy for themselves. We help them apply the theory to their own life as a way of helping them differentiate and helping them become more effective, more differentiated therapists themselves. I also will talk about my experience working with clients regarding family of origin therapy. Today's episode is a premium episode. In other words, it's a it's an episode that is just for patrons of the podcast. So if you're not a patron of the podcast, you will not be hearing the rest of the episode. <laughs> Sorry to tell you that. <laughs> it kind of sounds like I'm being a dick, but honestly, it's one of the benefits of becoming a patron. If you're a patron, you get access to all the episodes without any advertisements on our premium feed. So please become a patron by going to patreon.com and click on the button to become a patron. <laughs> you go to the Psychology in Seattle Patreon page, become a patron, and then I send you a, uh, instructions on how to access the premium feed, and then we're good to go. Also know that a portion of, our, uh, of, the, of your monthly pledge will go towards various charities that we support. 